What up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Yes, it's another Instant Pot video. Coming at you with a super simple brown rice in the Instant Pot video. This is super simple. I'm using water. You can use vegetable broth. You can add in seasoning, spices. I just wanted to show you guys how to do a super simple brown rice in the Instant Pot video in case you don't know how to do it because it's so simple and I don't know why I haven't made a video on this yet. So let me show you guys how it's done. Oh yeah, if you're brand new to my channel, make sure to hit that little subscribe button, like this video if this is a video you're into and want more of. And yeah, let's just get right into making this delicious brown rice. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is clearly plug in our Instant Pot. Boom, boom. Should say off once you plug it in. This is super simple, you guys. It's literally two ingredients. Couldn't be any easier. So the next thing you're gonna do is add in two cups of brown rice. You can use short grain brown rice or long grain brown rice. You can use whatever you'd like. You can use like mixed wild rice brown rice blend. This should work with any kind of like brown rice. Don't do this with white rice. There's a much shorter cooking time for white rice. So brown rice only. So two cups of brown rice going into the instant pot. And then you're gonna add in two and a half cups of water. Like I said, you can also use vegetable broth if you want, but I just use water to make it simple. So two and a half cups of that. Another thing you can also do if you prefer is to rinse your rice. A lot of people like to rinse their rice first. If you do that, then I would use two cups of water instead of two and a half cups of water. So rinsed rice, I would probably go two cups to two cups and that way it won't be too wet. But this is how I make mine. So I'm just showing you guys how to make it. If you want to rinse yours, go ahead and rinse. So then I just kind of like lift this up and swirl it around just to make sure it's all kind of mixed in there. And that's all. Let's put the lid on. Lock that in place. Make sure your valve is not on venting, but on sealing. So just turn that back like that until it's all the way back. And I know there's a rice button, but for some reason I started using the manual way and it turned out perfectly. So I just kept doing that way. So you're gonna hit the manual button. It should automatically be on high pressure. And then we're gonna do 22 minutes. So you're just gonna adjust that up to 22 minutes and it should beep and then it'll start. So after a couple seconds, it'll beep like that and now it's gonna come up to pressure, which usually takes about 10 minutes and then it'll cook for the 22 and then I'll show you what we do after, after it beeps, after it's all finished. Okay, so as soon as the 22 minutes are up, you're gonna hear 10 little beeps like that and you're gonna wait for this timer right here to come up to 10 minutes. And if you wanna set a separate timer, that's what I usually do so I don't forget. But as soon as those 10 minutes are up, I will show you what we do next. All right, so as soon as this little timer counts up to 10 minutes, then we're gonna manually release the rest of the steam by turning this back to venting from sealing. This is super hot. I always use a towel and I make sure that I'm not underneath my countertops because it will shoot, shoot steam up into there. So you're just gonna want to twist that and release the rest of the steam. All right, so that took about a minute for the rest of the steam to release. Two minutes, I lied. And now we can open up our Instant Pot. And inside we have beautifully cooked brown rice. So as soon as you open it up, you wanna take a fork and fluff it up, but then you're good to go. Look at that, you guys. Perfectly cooked brown rice every time. You don't have to worry about it on the stove. It's just good to go. It's seriously perfect brown rice every single time. I love this method. I love this so much. I make this at least once a week. So happy I'm finally sharing this video with you guys. So yeah, that's it. Beautiful brown rice in the Instant Pot. Doesn't take too long to cook and it's perfectly cooked every single time. So yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked this little Instant Pot video. If you liked it and you wanna see more, I have a whole playlist on my channel about Instant Pot recipes and such. So go check that out. I'll link that up top and down below. Make sure to give this video a little thumbs up if you liked it and hit that subscribe button if you're new and I'll just see you guys in my next video. Peace.